Okay, so we've done this before, but we're looking here and we're just wanting to say, okay, what number comes next in the pattern here? We see 0, it's hard to see, 0, 3, 6, 9, 12, 15. Can you guess what number comes next in this pattern? Okay, good job. Hopefully you noticed that the number that came next was 18. So then the next question that I have for you is, how do you know that that's the number came, that came next? What is it that you recognized was the pattern? Or in other words, how would you describe the pattern? See if you can go ahead and describe the pattern in English. Okay, so here we've described the pattern in English. It says the pattern moves up by three each time beginning at zero. So we're going up by three each time beginning at zero. So what would that look like, you know, if we were to write it out using math? Can you write that out using math? Okay, so we look here and we see that we've written out something that kind of reads, you know, the same up here. I'm going to see if we can get it to read the same. This says Y. Y is going to be this axis over here. And we're saying that's where we're going to put the, the next number in the pattern. And we say Y is equal to 3X plus 0. So what this means is that 3 each time and we're moving up by 3 each time means that we need a positive 3 and the X means each time and then this plus 0 means we're going to start at 0 we're going to begin at 0 we need to know where does the pattern begin and how does the pattern move so I want you to look here real close we have a we have a way of describing it right here this tells me where my pattern begins and this part right here, this 3, tells me how the pattern moves, okay? So we have a, a description of how the pattern moves, and then we have where it begins. So now we're going to go ahead and see if we can actually um, get that graph. See if you can draw out a graph for this um, to be turned in. Okay, take a look here. I've put in this line that says y is equal to 3x plus 0. Now look here, right here at the beginning of this x-axis here where it starts at 0. The first number on the y-axis is 0. When I move over 1, I go up here. The second number is at 3. All right? What was my next number on the list? 6. So if I move over from the first number to the second number, I'm up to 6. Go over to the third number, and I'm up to 9. Oh, man. How about the fourth number up to 12? The fifth number up to 15 right here. See the 15? And the sixth number is up to 18. So there are, that's proof that using this pattern will take us through the numbers 0, 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, and 18.